dude, so I was listening to this new song, uh-huh. and it kind of goes like, Soldier Boy up in it, oh, watch oh me crank God. that, watch me roll, yes. watch me crank that Soldier Boy, that Superman, that oh, that Wally, you! What, what? You have so much freaking talent, man. You think like, that so? was, like, beautiful. Thank you. Oh my God, you should, okay, so you should showcase that at the talent show today. Four <laughs> Scratch that. Auditions are actually being held March 6th and 7th in the PAC from 4 to 6 p.m. There's still a chance to sign up until Tuesday in the office. Seniors, if you're interested in getting a prom dress and you don't have the money to buy one, you can, you can go to the Camino Seco and 22nd Street location to get a prom dress from Promorama. It'll also include free haircuts, new shoes, and brand new prom dress, like the one pictured next to me. Well, that's all I have to say, so see you there. Attention AP students, your deposit is due by March 10th, and the deposit is a total of $15. Make sure to turn in your form and the deposit. Hi, my name is Fatima. If you're interested in student counselor for next year, please go to room G4 so you can apply for it. Hey guys, uh, if you've applied to Pima and have been accepted and you have your Pima ID number, it's very important that you sign up for the Pima assessment. This is basically your next step after applying to Pima to end up enrolling. This is the writing, reading, and math. This is basically for Pima to know what classes you're going to be getting uh, as soon as you enroll at Pima. This is going to be uh, Thursday, March 9th, uh, one of the labs here at Amphi High School. So instead of having you guys go all the way to a Pima campus, you have the opportunity to take those here at Amphi. As I said, Thursday, March 9th. All you need to do is sign up in the counseling office and this is first come first serve. We already have 13 students signed up and we only will accept 32. So again, sign up as soon as possible and don't forget to bring your Pima ID number. You know, I struggled for years to get through school. Studied at night. Crammed. <laughs> but you know what I think now? <laughs> I should have become a plant sooner. So Dylan Daniel was introduced to Meta, who's our Amplified News student, through a program for refugees over at the U of A, where they're making videos. And they got to talking, and Meta um, gave me Dylan's contact information. And uh, I emailed him, and, and uh, he was totally for coming and talking to the class. Dylan Daniels is an actor who has participated in multiple media stations, such as Disney Channel and Nickelodeon. Hey Panthers, so Student Council is having their very first Cultural Awareness Fair this March 31st. It's going to be during 4th period to lunch. If you would like to help out, attend, or show off your culture, please come to room G4 during 2nd period. Amphi lacks a lot of cultural beliefs and cultural awareness, so we are trying to unite every single culture that we have here at Amphi because it's such a diverse, diverse school. So please come out and celebrate. Sure. Did you know 100% of death is caused by death? Okay. Ms. Morales, can we ask you a very pressing question? What's up? 
Did you know if you held your breath and closed your eyes in a black hole, there is still a 100% chance of dying? Mm, no. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we have an urgent question. Did you know the leading cause of burns is my mixtape? <laughs> <laughs> I did not know that. Thanks for the information. Stay informed. Have a good day. Thank you. First, Dad. did you know that three fourths of Americans make up seventy five percent of Americans? Yes, I did. <laughs> All right, Matt. Shoot. Did you know that not having money is the leading cause of being poor? Absolutely. Oh my gosh! Thank you. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You are what is right with America. Have All a right. Good day. Thank you. You have to. You have to know the question and then react. All did right. you know that I am so cool? I can give you hypothermia just by looking at you. What? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, Mr. Havertsy, we have an urgent question that we need to know that you know right. that you are teaching our kids correctly. Did you know the average cloud is made up of dihydrogen monoxide? That's water, yes. <laughs> I did know that. Dihydrogen good. monoxide, that's good. Stay, stay frosty. Have a good day. <laughs> stay frosty. Yeah, did you know that you're getting really close to my face right now? <laughs>